childhood we know that one form of species can give another form of species this is evolution however it is a little different in real life evolution is not instant and it occurs over a period of time speciation is a form of evolution wherein one species gives rise to another species two organisms belong to the same species if they can interbreed and produce fertile offspring if organisms do not satisfy these two conditions they are considered to be of different species organisms belonging to the same species can look very different from each other but till the time they can successfully interbreed and give fertile offsprings they are considered to be of the same species speciation can occur in four ways allopatric sympatric peripatric and parapatric speciation consider a species of snails living together happily due to geographical isolation the population gets divided each divided population evolves separately after a time period they cannot reproduce together meaning they have evolved into two separate species this type of speciation due to geographical isolation is called as allopatric speciation peripatric speciation is similar to allopatric speciation wherein the geographical isolation occurs at the periphery isolating a small population this small population evolves separately from the parent population and over a period of time two separate species are formed that cannot mate with each other from the word peripatric we can remember that speciation is occurring at the periphery the geographical barriers in the allopatric and peripatric speciation can either be a river an ocean mountain valley etc in a large population random genetic differences can arise in a small population leading to altered preferences or behavior the new population evolves within the same area leading to the generation of a separate species which can no longer interbreed with the parent species this type of speciation wherein two species evolve together without any geographical isolation is called as sympatric speciation when the surrounding area or the niche of the population changes due to factors like pollution it leads to the generation of two niches one original niche and a second new niche which is formed due to pollution the species in the new niche undergoes random genetic differences to adjust to the polluted environment partial spatial isolation leads to parapatric speciation that is the snail in the clean in polluted area become two distinct species over a period of time however the two species are connected through a hybrid zone parapatric speciation is slightly different from sympatric speciation because the evolution of the new species takes place in a separate niche and in sympatric speciation the evolution of both the new species occurs together a similar effect is seen with a population around a large water body wherein continued differences in the species is observed due to the presence of garbage at one end in case of allopatric and peripatric speciation geographical isolation leads to genetic isolation however in case of sympatric and parapatric speciation genetic isolation leads to geographical isolation we can also say that this is due to the ecological isolation as the genetic differences changes the ecological behavior of the organism 
Also, we must note that peripatric and parapatric speciation both occurs in a small niche. To summarize it, allopatric speciation occurs due to geographical isolation and both the species evolve separately. Peripatric speciation is like allopatric speciation occurring at a small level where the geographical barriers separate the two species at the periphery and evolution occurs separately. In parapatric speciation, due to ecological changes, genetic differences occur leading to speciation. The evolution takes place in the adjacent niche. In sympatric speciation, ecological differences or random genetic differences takes place in a small population which then reproduces and evolve within the same population or the same niche as that of the parent population. If this video was helpful, then please like this video, share it with your friends, subscribe to my channel and don't forget to leave us your valuable comments. Thank you.